previously on Persona 3 Reload. I guess it's like, I call dibs on the plutonium. I guess there's no plutonium. Oh, wow, there is plutonium in there. Holy shit. Apparently, you think of everything. And now back to... Nico B, back with some more Persona 3 Reload. When we last left off, we finally saw the beginning of summer vacation. Yeah! Which means I can't hang out with most of my social links. Yeah! But at least I aced the exams. Yeah, again! And I'm also training to become the fastest runner there ever was. Look how fast I can go. But it didn't matter because I still lost in the end. God damn it! But I got a new social link. Yeah, again! I also made a deal with literally Satan himself. Look at him, there he is. He's standing right there. He's got the horns and everything. Who promised me that he's gonna still keep all that money I gave him, but in return, he's gonna give me the benefit of hanging out with me. Oh, what a nice guy. I'm totally gonna blackmail this guy when this is all over. Also, Karamaru got attacked by a shadow in the real world and he got hurt. Ah! But thankfully the dog has a persona, cause well, why not, right? The, act, the actual dog, real life dog, not a no, weird cartoonish bear or a weird cartoonish cat. No, the real dog, just a dog. He can't talk or he's just a dog. You hear that dog? Which is why Karamar will always be best boy. But we've also got uh, some more people lost in Tartarus. And you guys informed me that apparently that's it. That, that's actually all the people that are gonna be lost here so I can go whenever I want now. But damn, are they, look at this shadow, look how close they're cutting it. So just like today, and it's like, oh yeah, that's our fine. I just got like, you know, three days left. No problem. Those motherfuckers. By the way, the guy I was thinking of who I was getting uh, the new social link confused with was uh, Daisuke. That's right. And it, it wasn't uh, it wasn't track team, it was soccer. Because you can choose between the soccer team and the basketball team in Persona 4. That's right. Sorry, it's been a while. Also, you guys mentioned that Inagawa's lectures, you know, tie closely to the main, major themes of this game, you know, in terms of magic and such, arcane. And I, I know, I know, I know. Unfortunately, it doesn't make it any less fucking boring and drawn out, in my opinion. Like, it would one thing if it was like the same length as everybody else's, because I think that stuff can be interesting, but his shit, I swear to God, his lectures are like four times longer than any other teacher. And after a while, I'm just like, dude, this motherfucker just needs to shut up. <laughs> I don't care if you work here. You're a video game teacher, okay? You're like, oh, does anyone know plus two plus two? And I say five and you say wrong and then we move on. That's not supposed to go. But anyway, last episode, uh, Color Printer said, so fun fact about Tanaka's social link. In the original release of Persona 3, not FES, Tanaka was originally a daytime social link. In FES, he was moved to nighttime. This created a bit of an issue. That issue being, you can use him to skip the final boss. No spoilers, I'll be as vague as possible here. On the very last night, every activity that progresses time is no longer available aside from go do the end game. All except one. When you give Tanaka the third and final payment on the final day of the game and start the social link, time passes afterward and it goes to the next day. It goes straight past the final boss and into the ending sequence. Entire end game completely skipped. How is it possible? Simple. When they moved Tanaka to nighttime, they forgot to make him unavailable on the final night. Oops. Fun fact about the fun fact, while this was made widely known in 2018, someone on GameFAQ stumbled onto this skip in 2008. Wow, that must be a uh, a uh, beloved technique from freaking speedrunners, right? Because I mean, let's all be honest, all right? The final boss of this game, it's awesome, but it's also like the longest final boss in Persona history. Seriously, I'm actually gonna be curious if it's as like insanely long in this game. I predict it will be. I predict they're gonna probably keep that shit here. They could stream, quote unquote, streamline it and make it much shorter, but I don't know. I, I think the devs are probably like, nah, come on. It's like part of the charm in this game is this insanely long final boss that God, you, you really hope that you didn't die like 30 minutes into it. Otherwise you gotta start all over again. But yeah, I, I imagine any speedrunners like any chance to skip that shit is welcome and actually and i think about it, it would be wouldn't even be that hard to do you don't even have to like go through all of tanaka's social link you just have to get him like ready for payment and on the final payment and save for the last day so yeah that's like super doable funny i i did not realize that actually i never really watched any speed runs of persona games funny enough but I imagine they're even with like being able to skip through stuff, you know, of like the modern day games. I bet it's, still t it's a very long playthrough. But Color Printer, thank you so much for your uh, interesting fun factoid about our little Satan man here. And it is for that reason you are comment of the day. All right. So uh, we are still in the middle of summer vacation. Uh, my pals are hanging out out here. I do not have that many social links to actually hang out with uh, during the daytime, but we're going to make do. 
Do you remember that shadow from the other day? I'm talking about the one Korachan defeated. Anyway, for some reason, it reminded me of something Kurija Senpai said. How about normal shadows don't usually appear outside Tartarus, but some regular ones do? I guess they appeared sometime back when it was just our senpais who were fighting them. Wait, did I? S I could have swore we. I, I had this conversation with you. There was a highlight over your head, though. Am I just taking a time loop? What's going on? Wait, are you going to say? Regard my persona. It's persona excels in endurance. Basic attacks will do little against me. In other words, I am a tough guy. Uh, uh, no, that definitely, that's definitely new. I suppose operation didn't go smoothly because the enemy behaved unexpectedly. So I'm going to do some visualization training and exercise to ensure that doesn't happen again. I'll do my best to support everyone. You know what? I, this thing just sort of occurred to me, actually. What happens if you don't actually reach the the top floor of a section in this game? I, I, I'm like actually sort of realizing, does that actually matter? Is it just to get you powerful enough to be able to fight uh, the the shadow, the, the the full moon shadow? Is that what it really is? I almost actually wonder then like, I don't know, maybe you just don't even need to necessarily get to the top of Tartarus for b before the next full moon. We're not even like saying like, yo, have you gotten to the top of Tartarus or anything? You haven't gotten to that next checkpoint? No one's actually saying that to me. So maybe I don't even need to. I mean, I'm going to anyway. I'm just, I'm actually just curious, is it necessary? I'm sure at the end of the game it is, but for these ones, I'm not sure. Not bad. is in quite high spirits, huh? Maybe he just doesn't want to lose to Karamaru. I just don't understand that feeling. I don't like the idea of some dog swooping in and hogging all the glory. Right. Our glory. Red of Tartarus, I'll join you. I want to go wild tonight. Go wild. By the way, I thought you'd like to know, Karamaru's condition seems to be improving. Glad to hear. I'm still worried. I love him. Don't worry, he'll be all right. Try to focus on the shadows for now. See what's on TV. Next on Vacation Corner, we'll show a world famous beach. You may have already heard of it. Southern Miami in the US of A. Never heard of it. Let's see what they have to say. Hi, welcome to Miami, which is filled with tourists this time of year. On to today's newscast. Shuichi Nomura, second year at Iwatonai High School in Yasuko Murabayashi, 51, a housewife in the Bay Area. Reportedly missing earlier today. Please are searching for leads and ask the public for assistance. And yeah, yeah, you know, you better get on that shit, Bizzle. Yeah, I'm working on it. Whatever, TZ, TV guy, get off my ass. Warrant it, right? Seriously, though, I think the real question is what the fuck was that Miami segment? Lay said two things and peaced out. It's like a waste of my fucking time. They show some beach babes or something. Fuck. Oh my god, we got a new burger. Down this wild burger. Wild that burger, yeah. I don't give a shit, Donald. Your burger sucks anyway. So unfortunately, Maiko is actually not ready for today. Damn, Maiko goes through, I think, a number of these. Well, actually, I think it's only might be the second one, but whatever it happens, it is like, fuck. But I mean, uh, that got chunky, kid. To be honest, I think it's just like, if I'm gonna like, at a, some later point, spend a day at Naganaki Shrine to build up her social link, I might as well just do it with her now. So just since I really don't have like, many options anyway. So I know some people are like, oh, just do the ones that are available currently. But Maiko's only available sometimes, and this fat fuck's available every single demon day. So I think in this instance, it's probably best to just hang out with her. Because you can't actually do any um, nighttime, like, building of bonds. Like, the Naganaki Shrine is not actually open at night. Hi, Maiko. Hi, uh, yep, yeah, you have today off, right? I have cramp school right now, but I'm not going. Screw them, they're a bunch of meaties. Are you playing with me? Sure. I figure your parents would probably not let you see me anymore after <laughs> seemingly encourage you to run away. Even though it was really all your idea and I just didn't say anything. <laughs> what do you want to do today? Bono grew stronger. Okay, good. Good. Uh, Pizzle Son. Oh, sorry. How was your day today? Well, there will be a full moon on Thursday. Probably should do something. You know, it's coming quickly. Maybe we should go. Go do the thing! But Mitsuru's available to hang out. We can go cook something for no reason. Who's up here? Oh, it's fucking Junpei? Junpei, what the fuck are you doing? Reading a book, dude. Now I think about it, I wonder if it, I, I will actually get a characteristic, you know? I bet I will. It's probably like a main story thing. All right, I think I'm gonna hang out actually with Junpei tonight. I mean, I could I could just go to Tartarus, but you know what? Let's just push this shit to the last fucking minute because uh, I also gotta get his, I gotta get his move, you know? I don't know if I'm going to have enough time to get uh, another planting thing with him. But he also doesn't seem like he does, the, like, he comes up here to do this reading thing very often. Looks like there's only an education manga here. Man, I wish they had some shonen stuff. 
Oh, well. At least I have that one that bar from what's his name. Yeah, you want to read too? It's just baseball manga that fished a while back. And my courage will go up? Sure. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what I like to hear. Procrastinating, not going to Tartarus, doing the thing we should be doing. Hell yeah, brother. This one's pretty old, so the art's got a retro feel to it. Guess it's supposed to feel nostalgic, right? The main character's got thick seaweed eyebrows. Hey, what do you think of these old classics? Mine's got huge tits in it. They're very tasteful. I prefer modern styles. They're timeless masterpieces. Whoa! Dropping some wisdom! Damn, Mark! I hear you, though. The best manga know exactly how to light a fire in your heart. Oh, crap! Gotta keep going! Bottom of the night. Two outs, bases loaded, and a home run will change it all. Boy, heroes in a real pickle. Hey, you better read faster or else I'm gonna spoil it for you. Damn, this is where it ends? I should have borrowed more volumes. It gets even crazier than this if I remember right. Man, the main character's rival? Fill that courage up. Has anyone invented Crunchyroll yet? That Shonen app or whatever? Just go look this shit up online. I'll borrow the rest of them so we can pick it up next time. Well, I'm gonna hit the hay. Never been super into big into like the the sports manga. I don't know. Oh, who the goddamn demon lord is it? Guess who's bored? Uh, I think I, I think we did this before and nope. Yeah, there's no point. There's no point. I'm sorry, Yuko. I wish there was a point. Uh, oh, it's so hot. It's just gonna feel like summer. I don't want to get heat exhaustion before the next operation, so I'm gonna stay inside today. I'm gonna ch chill the fuck out and do her nails or whatever. I do not have nails to do. I have, a, I have finger guns. See, I like Agus better for that. Wish I had finger guns. All right, let's go hang out with the uh, old couple. Getting close to the end of their social link. Oh my dear, there's a mistake there. That's not how you write, Gekokon. I know, I know. Ah, oh, damn it, you're right. I wrote Geico Gecko again. Fuck me. I hardly ever write it, so I just forgot how it looked for a second. I feel a little bad for all the people who've been campaigning to save the tree. Oh, huh, speak of the devil. I find it funny that I feel like I've had like absolutely no impact on this story in any way. <laughs> Other than, I mean, I'm, I'm here for the this old couple, which is nice, but literally like the, the petitioning for the tree and all that shit, I literally didn't do anything. I did fucking nothing. This story would have been absolutely fine if I wasn't here. Uh, I'm writing a letter, something I haven't done in ages. I'm used to the keyboard doing all the work for me. What, is that surprising? I'm actually quite the net surfer, you know. Oh, for that sweet, sweet titty. What's the letter say? No, oh, no, no, don't look. Oh, I'm shy. <laughs> we'll tell you when the time is right. Oh. Are you curious about the letter? Excited, perhaps? Even exhilarated? Excited. We are too. Your enthusiasm is contagious, you know. Just talking with you is enough to make our hearts race. Just look at my wife. She's as giddy as a schoolgirl. The two seem to trust me deeply. I feel like we're growing closer. Ah, uh, they're so precious. They're such precious little beans. said, uh, I hope we can wrap up the matter before your next visit. Okay. Welcome back. What's up, dude? Day after tomorrow's full moon, huh? I'm already getting fired up. Let's kick some ass. We haven't been to Tars once. We're all gonna fucking die today. Yeah! During those seasons, it's exa really exhausting. I'd like to bring a bit more range of movement on my body. I should start, stop rethinking my pacing. Maybe chill out for the summer? Don't be stupid, stupid. Shadows are getting tougher. No matter what we do, there's no time to rest. I gotta get fucking buffer. Protein! It's honestly hot as hell. At least I'm the one cool dude. Bazinga, baby! 
Anyways, you know you can always count on me, right? Our enemy's got nothing on me. Yeah, you're the one, only one that has got his fucking ability yet. Actually, technically, technically, I guess that's neither, but she's new, all right? Doesn't count. What's on TV tonight, anyway? Libra's lucky color is black. Hey, I'm a Libra. For uh, extra luck, get yourself stuck in the train doors on purpose. <laughs> ah! 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 Fucking like cuts you in half. Hi, ah! Kari. I've been able to stop thinking about that show, how the show ended last time, so I borrowed the next DVD. Watch the show increase our charm. We are sadly not ready to get your your next skill, but whatever. Let's watch zombie shit. Yes. All right, let's get into it. This series always has such crazy plot twists. When the main girl's best friend betrayed her, I was like, what? What the fuck? Being backstabbed by the one person you trusted most is just horrible. What would you do if that happened to you? I'd kill him. It's whatever I'd never recover, forgive and forget. That's awfully admirable. You sound just like the main character. No, I'd, I'd, I'd fucking stab him in their sleep. To be honest, there was once a girl I was close to who suddenly started avoiding me. It wasn't a full-blown betrayal or anything, but I was so hurt by that. It's hard to forgive and forget. Oh shit, it's starting! It's so fast-paced, we really need to pay attention. If you weren't always talking over all the dialogue. Oh no way! It's just gonna end like that? Ugh, it happens every time. But they're so good at leaving you hanging. I need to know how it ends. Let's watch more next time, okay? By preserving the main character, I've got more charming somehow. By preserving the main character, you get fucking ripped to shreds by a zombie. I became a charismatic god! Yeah! Well, that's dope. That's my first stat maxed out. It means I'm actually ready to uh, start a Yukari social link. Whenever school starts back again. Damn, all right. Well, I was on the literally on the, the teetering edge of that shit. It's getting pretty late. We better head back to our rooms. Hello, I'm calling to let you know that all those people in Tartarus are dead. Got a text message. Hey, Frit! No, nope. an old man's request. I'm sorry, uh, Boonkeys. You're gonna have to save. Uh, it, I mean, it's the end of your social link, right? No, it's not the end of your social link. Oh, hey, there's Hayase. Oh, I can hang out with him. Oh, that's awesome. Yes, I wish I could do that today, but I have to go. Actually, wait. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. no. It's it's not till nighttime. I can't do that today. We can start that shit. All right, we're definitely doing that today. I have a distinct feeling this guy's gonna be the star since he's like the star player. Oh, hey, there's Junpei. Damn, dude, lost everywhere these days. Maybe we should have our have own theme song, you know? Who you gonna call? Shadow Busters! Uh, I think we'd probably get sued for that, Junpei. Yeah, yeah, probably, but it's gonna be cool, right? Right? Yeah, I know, I guess it makes sense that this guy would be an out of school one since he technically doesn't go to our school. Hey, Bizzle, you remember me, huh? I'm gonna grab a bite to eat. Wanna join me? Sure. Yeah. So you can run faster. This has to run a hundred laps around the city. Ready? I, I do not remember anything about this social link. Yeah, so he's full of confidence. I can feel the courage welling up within me. Take him on. Ah, uh, okay. I, I need I needed courage to be able to face him. Hmm? Hey, eat up. Slowing down. Is that all you've got? Come on, eat faster! It's not over yet. You wanna see what I got? That's the forbidden burning tongue technique. And I'll do it too. You're a god. Go, 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 go! Ow! Hot, hot! Oh, my insides are on fire, but I don't care. Uh, this is a sweet taste of victory. <laughs> oh god, oh god, it's melting through my tongue. I was saying I finished eating at the same time. Looks like it's a tie. I gotta take a shit. <laughs> Not many people can keep up with me. I'm impressed. Bizzle? Thought I could win. That's so. Guess it was close then. Oh. I had a lot of gods challenging me at Takoyaki though. I respect that. I knew you had potential when I met you. Hey, I'll say it's a fierce smile on his face. Star Runner from another school has taken a shine to me. The Star Runner, huh? Yep, it's a star. Makes sense. 
Is that what the star means? Like, in the arcana? That seems pretty on the nose, almost. I don't know. I don't know if it's as simple as, like, because you're just the best. Uh, maybe it is. I always thought the, the star, fa the face on the star in the arcana always looks really funny. Something kind of like, kind of like that, uh, that meme face, you know? What was it, like, the Larry face or something? It's like, it's used for horny shit. The way I see it, ties no better than a loss. I'll do like I promise and run a hundred laps around the city. You do whatever you think is best. Heck of a fight today. See you around. All right, I see why I lost this guy. This guy's a psycho. So I go back to the dorm and finally go do the thing that I probably should be doing. Nah, fuck it. Nah, I'm just going to fight this shadow. Oh, welcome back. Oh, hey, welcome back. Well, tomorrow's full moon. You ready, Fizzle Coon? Oh, yeah. Good, me too. Well, aside from being ready mentally, we have to get physically prepared. We all stand by the dorms tomorrow, so let's get everything to everything tonight. And nobody wants to go to uh, nobody wants to go to Tartarus tonight. That'd be hilarious. By hilarious, I mean fuck. And actually, this is the perfect night to go because Aoliaki is available, and we've already finished his. Hey. I just have to make sure I finish it one night, like I have been. Start getting nervous about tomorrow. I think I'm gonna check him one more time, make sure I'm fully prepared. Hello. Do you need some time to get used to the operations? I'm good, thanks. Yes. <laughs> Enough already. <laughs> good luck on the next one as well. I'll be rooting for you in the shadows. <laughs> I, I almost wish it. Wait, hold on. Can I do that again? Yeah. Enough already. <laughs> ah, did I bomb that one? Good luck on that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I just want to say that in one time. Excuse me. The population of Lost increases noticeably for a full moon. I have reconfirmed my objective to ensure we win at any cost, no matter what. Time to win this time, too. I'll give it everything I've got so I can see Korachan again that he's gotten better. Uh, he's a good boy. We're on TV. Has begun today! This time the pledge leader was a student from another winning school. What the fuck? Alright. Before we go home, though. No. Seriously, that Takayaki fucked me the shit up. It's too hard! It's too so hard! Okay, I probably shouldn't eat Takayaki like that again. Alright, we're going to Tartars, baby. Let's go. Let's go save those fuckers before they demon die today. And also, finally, get to use I guess. As of today, I will be joining in the operations to explore Tartarus. I am ready for deployment. All right, sounds good. No feet, girl. I have also been equipped with a number of combat functions, in addition to the ability to summon a persona. I will provide more details later, but suffice to say, you won't want to miss it. <laughs> you won't want to miss. You're not gonna want to miss this shit. Don't blink. Looking forward to it. Don't get carried away. Can you transform into a fucking car? Currently, I am not outfitted with any functions that enable me to morph or transform. But I can make my boobs bigger. Look at this. That's gonna probably be useful at some point. I'm sure. I apologize for being unable to meet your expectations. However, I am prepared to undergo modifications if the situation demands it. Okay. Our current objective is the elimination of the large shadows that appear during a full moon. In order to accomplish this, it will be crucial to gather combat data in Tartarus. Please make efficient use of my facilities so that we may achieve our goal. When I guess Theurgy engages Max, her Theurgy or Orgia mode can be used. Once Orgia mode is uh, activated, I guess will automatically attack during her turn for three rounds unprompted during orgia mode her attack and defense will increase significantly keep in mind that once orgia mode ends i guess will overheat running her immobile for her next turn yeah it's sort of weird like okay so they they've brought this back in the original game i think i can't remember if you could activate this at any time i, I don't remember if i used it like at all because the thing is it basically makes her go berserk Berser berserko mode you can't control her well actually Technically, I can't control my party members in the original FES either. So, I don't know. Maybe she just did it on her own randomly. I'm not sure, actually. I, I don't. I don't. I, I know this was in the original game, but I don't remember how it functioned. So, I mean, I yeah, okay. I I don't know. This, this sort of in, instinctively doesn't sound that great. It, oh, it does actually do. It it does do damage too. Okay. It does like when you activate it, it does do a bunch of damage at least. Just because it sort of relies on the AI, you know having to do something, and I just hope they don't fuck it up. Oh, card in the hand is reacting. Multiple major arcana cards have been added to the shuffle. Hierophant, the level of your currently equipped persona will be incre will increase by one. 
Uh, okay. Lovers. Increases social link bonuses for Persona Fusions until you leave Tartarus. I've been waiting for you. Have a moment of your time. Oh, wait. Fuck. I just realized something. I you forgot to so. talk to the fortune teller. Shit. Hold on, let me go back. Huh, I wonder if it's better. So we got like a rarity one, increased chance of encountering rare enemies and then have increased chances of enemies turning into strong or rare enemies. So this seems like I, like you could you can potentially get more rare rare enemies, but they could also be strong enemies that like, I guess is a gamble. And then increase the rate, rate at which their gauges charge. I wonder if you can like, can you get like multiple per trip? I'm gonna go with this one this time, the strong and rare. Double-edged sword. Chances of the chance of events occurring that turn all shadows on the floor into rare strong shadows has increased when exploring. Wait, what? Oh, the chance of event occurring that all shadows on a floor will be rare or strong. Uh oh, oh, that's crazy. That's nutty. Okay, I see. I get it now. So everybody on there could be fucking. Everybody's strong or everybody's rare. Everybody rare is gonna, that'd be nuts. Uh, can you actually like get any more? Too much of a good thing to turn for, okay. Uh, no, the answer is no. Now, what is Elizabeth? If I may say so. While awaiting your arrival, I sense something shifting within Tartarus. A number of strange doors have appeared there, it seems. Where these doors lead, whether this boats ill or well, even I do not have that knowledge. However, I believe you have the with wherewithal to find out. Take the leap. You may discover something useful. I can do that. Uh, what is it though? Excellent. I have faith in you. <laughs> Those who challenge the unknown, choosing risk over comfort, often chief greatness. But at least this challenge necessarily facilitates some form of growth. Your coach will lead to your betterment, Nico. I sincerely hope you will continue to act on it. Something weird's going on in Tartarus. These doors, should I go investigate? What? Okay, she, I actually know that that is not related to the fortune thing I got because she was already calling me over before I, I reset the game. All right, so where are these folks at? Should be someone between floor 78 and 81. Okay. Very we'll have to go through that anyway. Naturally. Hmm. Sure, Amon is mature for his age, but don't you think Yucatan's giving him too much credit? It'd be nice if she praised me like that once in a while. Come on, give me head pats. Tell me I'm a good boy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Madakun's really mature for his age. Definitely think of someone who could learn a thing or two from him. <laughs> Amada may track like act like an adult, but he's still in elementary school. Well, we're, we're all just talking about Mana here. He seems to look up to you as a role model, so please try to help him out where you can. Hmm. The news of Amada joining us in the dorm sure wasn't expected. Even it's only temporary. Honestly, I've got reservations about that, but that doesn't matter right now. Get distracted by the outside things while in Tartar is only an end in failure. Yes. Make sure to try out my orgy mode, please! Oh, I thought you were going to talk about Amada. Who the hell is Amada? I don't care. Orgy mode! According to Amada-san's profile data, he should be dor dormant in his bedroom at this time. Therefore, it's highly unlikely that Amada-san will be able to detect our current activities. Mm. Amada is really put together, and he speaks so politely, too. I'm sure his parents really cared about him. He's a good boy. Where do we stop at, anyway? 69, dude! All right, who are we uh, starting off here? The nice thing is... It as you're getting more characters, you know what that essentially means is it allows you to cycle out of characters and not have to worry about restoring SP for somebody else, you know? Not to mention, you know, trying to keep everybody on the same level. Akiko has to be in the group, uh, because he's such a... Damn, how did I get so fucking high? Wow. I think some of those fights must give me a fuck ton of experience. Yeah, I guess they did. Jesus Christ, how did I get this many levels above Junpei? Uh, I do kind of want to try, uh... Try, I guess. Though Mitsuru is a technically lower level, so I guess we'll stick with her for now. Oh yeah, that's right. Hilarious that she's weak to lightning as a robot, which is makes sense, right? Uh, nah, let's do I guess. Come on. We just got her. We gotta test her out. Yeah, and hers after using physical skills, her ability to her drive to complete her mission intensifies. Okay. And she is literally physical physical skill character. Alright. Here we go. Getting a fake reading of a person. It could be one of the people who got lost in here. It's too far to pinpoint their location. Seems to be on a much higher floor. Okay, let's get to it. All right, I'm hoping we get a new uh, biome change here because I'm getting sick and tired of fucking M uh, HR Giger area. Uh-huh. Just be able to get past it. Oh, hey, I also, I just realized that, look, I do my 
Oh, this must be the... Uh, ooh. Oh, wow. Uppercut. This is the ambush move. There it is. Please watch out. Slurp. So shaking aside, is everyone all right? Paths towards the staircase is opened up. You can advance further now. All right. All right, let's go. Wonder what the next stair is going to be like. All right, let's keep moving. Oh hell yeah! Ooh, it's actually a slightly more subdued version. Doesn't have that dude like the drums in the back. It's like a slight. Ch -ch -ch. Got a techno uh, look about us this time around. Oh yeah, drop my ambush move too. Baby, baby, baby. Uh, all right. I guess let's give you a try, girl. Gosh, she's got fucking error rent. That's such a good one. Any of the ones that can hit multiple times like this are insanely good. Here we go. The last of the anti shadow suppression weapons. Yes, last. Boom! Oh, all week to that shit. They knew. They knew we want to try her out. Ah, uh, uh, the lovers. Social link bonuses for Persona Fusions will increase. Heck yes. And we got a big one here. Oh god, it's one of these things. So you can't inflict fear on this guy. Balls. Mabufula. Ow. All right. What's this guy weak to? Lightning. I got that too, baby. Oh. You car having you re -re is so nice. Thank God. There we go. Big EXP. And there goes Junpei. Whoa. Whoa, these are fucky looking, dude. What the shit? Whoa. Whoa. Okay. I mean, I'm sure we, I'll be seeing this these layouts a lot, but first time seeing it, it's kind of, it is kind of wild. I gotta try out my damn ambush move. I keep forgetting, but I, I, it's funny you have, to, you have to actually essentially build up speed to get it. Oh yeah, give me that good shit. Woo! Yes, show me that I guess splash screen. I already got you, Take. They are finished. Target neutralized. I like everyone has a color theme. I guess this is yellow. Yeah, I guess it's cool. She's cool. It's funny. I don't think I'm actually moving any faster, though, when I enter this mode, this, this state. I just get the blue streak. Found the stairs. Wanna head up? Yeah, it's actually, it's funny. The, the way, though, it's set up, too, it gets kind of confusing because you're looking at this like these look like pathways, right? When you look at on 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 your screen, but when you look at the mini map, you see no, they're just walls. They are in fact just walls. Is this some kind of machine? I wonder what it, what it's powered by. Great. This whole place is a machine. Powered by our dreams. Freaking uppercut, baby. Show to you, Ken. It's incredible. It's like a three-dimensional labyrinth. It's so hard to tell where to go. My head's killing me. I'll tell you, I know where we're going. We're gonna hit this fucker. Arrgh! It'd be awesome if I distressed it. No distress. I can't remember if you guys said if it was like completely random whether you distressed the enemy, or if you guys said it's uh you have to hit you have to hit him in the back while doing that. So the way this works is that you essentially can ambush anybody, right? From any angle now. And then sometimes you'll distress them. I I don't know. I don't know if it's if it's random or if it has to be from the back. Oh, fucking hell. These little dodgy dickheads. Immune to wind. Okay. Uh-oh. Are you just, like, immune to everything? They're slapping you. What we got? Oh, it is. It's all physical. 
You want to be able to hit him multiple times. So if I can hit him with this fucking move, it'd be great. Yes, 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 like that. Yukari actually has a bow that, ah, is supposed to inflict, uh, or have high, uh, critical hit chance, too. Oh, my God. My bad. Uh, yeah. Fuck. All right, well, we know for next time, at least. Damn, I lose a lot of HP, though, from using those moves. All right, got him from the back, and oh, I, he is distressed. After getting from the back. Oh, oh, there's the critical. Oh, days, that's what I'm talking about, bitch. Oh, yep, and they high critical again. Boom, boom, boom. Do it again. Oh. Unfortunately, we can't actually knock him down now. All right. Got locked chest. We got Spirit Talisman. Have I got one of these before? What the fuck was that? Oh, it's one of the weird doors. I guess. What's this? I think something new has appeared on this floor. It's something huge, but I'll give you another heads up when you're closer to it. It triggered the moment I got that chest. Spirit Talisman plus 30 SP. I got another item that did that. Oh, wait, no, no, no. This is just wow. It was a fairy talisman. It was plus 20. Now plus 30? Jesus. So, yeah. Up, uh, upgrade, uh, pizzas here. I think this device caused that tremor just now. The fuck is it? The ring that I'm getting from it is similar to the one from the entrance. The shape is similar as well. Could it be a portal leading somewhere? Better take a closer look. Whoa. Something seems different about this floor. This clock, maybe like the one on the first floor? There's a booklet in front of the clock. The title on the cover reads Great Clock Manual. For those who seek to gain greater power from a common experience, to activate the Great Clock, a prerequisite quantity of Twilight Fragments is required. After an offering is made and the hands strike 12, the Great Clock can be used. The observer shall then reach for the pendulum while picturing a recipient of the clock's power. Last day of the month, activity verified. The document seems to be from 10 years ago. The clock's hands are already pointing at 12. Might as well follow the instructions and picture one of my teammates. If you've used a Twilight Fragment in Tartarus, an entrance to a special dimension where the great clock may appear. Oh, the great clock gr grants a large experience boost to a teammate of your choosing. Although you can only choose allies at a lower level than Nico, the greater the level difference, the bigger the bonus. Remember the, oh, wow, that's so, oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. So this will help essentially curb those moments where like, oh, a party member gets like a little left behind. Like, you know, you didn't use them enough. So they are like, or didn't use them during that last boss fight. So they get left in the dust like Junpei. Remember the answers only appear after you've used a Twilight Fragment. So don't be shy about using them. However, the entrance to the, the clock will vanish if you move to another floor, so be sure to, to use them while they appear. Select a teammate to receive a growth. Junpei will grow from level 24 to 27 in the next battle. Well, that's a uh, fucking incredible. Holy shit. I, okay, it, an EXP, I thought it meant, but it said EXP was like, oh, you're just gonna get like more EXP for the next few fights. No, we're just gonna level him up to like your level. Oh, I could choose another teammate too? Sure. What the? Well, that's fucking cool. What? Is everyone all right? Oh, we're back here now. It's like I thought you lost you all, but then it was like you just teleport here. What an odd place. What do you think would be the deal with that clock? Seems like we could use it. It seems helpful. It'll be smart to make us make use of it. it doesn't seem dangerous. Maybe it actually has a positive effect on everyone? And just opens up again. Let's try it. Excuse me, sorry. I have a feeling that I'll do especially well in there right now. Could you please include me in your party? I've been waiting for you. Uh, uh, oh, I lost it back again. Marvelous. In the wake of your recent expedition, I bear news which may be of interest to you. It seems that at this moment, your bonds will have a uniquely beneficial effect on the creation of new personas. If you wish to take advantage of this opportunity, please visit the Velvet Room. 
Ah, yes, based off the uh, uh, the thing I got, the the lover's card. All right, uh, Mitsuru. I'm gonna switch out I guess then. No All right. <laughs> and then. Blah, 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 blah. Whoa! Holy shit! Yeah, I'm getting decked. <laughs> I'm getting decked. Uh, Torrent shot. Uh, two to four hits. Nice. Uh, all right, we can get rid of fucking power slash. Next up's Agilau. I've learned a new skill. Uh, Fatal end. Oh, oh, she actually learned Spirit Drain. Well, that's dope. Deal medium slash damage to one foe. Chance of inflicting fear. McCoy, I eat Gumby. No, I think it's a chance. I hit this one in the back while doing the ambush move, and it it didn't uh, it didn't distress them. So just a, just a chance it will happen. Fucker, Mr. Kitty, Mr. Kitty Persona, the most powerful of all personas. What in the fuck are those? It's a powerful enemy up ahead. Please be careful if something take it on. No matter how strong the enemy, there's always some way to get in the upper hand. He's maintaining your composure long enough to seize the opportunity when it presents itself. That might make sure you're rested and prepare for battle. Can't be killing over after the first blow. For fighting a stronger enemy, there's a skill of mine I'd like to use. It's called Sylphid Aura. Sylphid Aura is a support skill that automatically raises the defense and accuracy of the whole party at the beginning of combat. The effect's duration lasts between floors, but will be canceled after entering battle. It's basically lost for decisive battles and key encounters. Cool. It'll hit everyone's abilities a bit at start. Might give you some peace of mind. This is this is on a higher floor. It's a floor we haven't been to yet. Okay. Let's just get the fuck out of here. Oh my my my! What have we here? Currently, you paired up as a great number of personas. Uh, curse you being used by more powerful. Yeah. Okay. Get in the fucking velvet room. All right. Fine. I get you. Good day. Oh. Also, get requests. Are you accepting a request? Uh, twenty-three or above. Yeah, sure. Sugar key. Hey, King Frost. And a person with torrent shot. I already got you. Takamir. Hey, I confuse our send finally. Is this acceptable? Behold. Cool. Do oh, desire. Aeon. Nidhogger? This power might be too. This is way big. above my level. Holy shit. Not a runda. Mudoon! Ooh, I can make Pale Rider. I eat literally death. Behold! Hi there, I'm fucking death. Should you so back and I should rise and ladies dance to the call? Ah, la, 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 la. I'm gonna bite ya. Amudo, uh, Aiga, and survive light. Man, chance that you survive a one light insta kill attack with one HP remaining. Sure! Come on, we have to get my boy Arsene. We have to. I don't have enough money for him, damn it! Never mind! Sexy snake lady. Let me ask you to turn the flames of vengeance to a fiery force. Force me to wield. She's about to get a fuck ton of experience. Big fat boost. Oh man. Ooh, she gets some good shit. Increased chance of poison. Medium chance to poison all foes. High chance to stagnant air, yes! Increase the chance of inflicting animals to all combatants. Hell yes. I also got a soul seed dribblet. It's funny, I, mean, I, I I'm about to end a fight here, and I feel like I, I have to have Yukari in my party because her healers are just so good. Not to mention she lose like her new ability allows her to cast healing magic with less costing less SP. I had a gamble of fortune red today. Apparently my destiny holds a double-edged sword. Maybe I'll run to unusual enemies. You're telling me that now? Yes, I've been here for a while though. Alright, first we gotta get past the fucking Weird uh, hourglass things over here. Let's do it. If you're not gonna move, then I'll make you move! Or we just walk around you, but nah. -na -na -na. I suppose I didn't use uh, Fuka's uh, move at the start of the fight. Oh well. Aha! Weak to ice, good. Good thing I brought you. Ow, uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is how it happens. Ah! Uh, uh, blah, 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 blah. Mincer's dead. Came with that poison mist. 
Eh, <laughs> blocked it. I guess go into orgy mode. She obtained the power of a god. Unfortunately, we're all about to die. Blech. Blech. Yeah, you know what? I'm fucking not fine. We're just fucking gonna redo that. All right, Sylphid Aura. Ah, there we go. All right, orgy mode again. Knock somebody over. Ah, oh, swift strike. Oh, wow. Oh, it makes it all glowing and shit. It looks so cool. And screw this. Get out here, Jack brothers. Hey, brother. What's well, airplanes? Hey, what's up with that? Oh, thank you. Good night, brother. Haha. Oh, God. Oh, missed one. Son of a bitch. Whatever. You're fucking done, son. Beat his ass. Oh, yeah. Big experience. All right. Did it. Greetings. Enemy defeated. Requesting our next directive. Let's keep exploring. Let's turn back for a day. What would you like to do, I guess? Well, I had not anticipated a query in response to my query. Is this what they call getting blindsided? But I do not have a plain blind set to speak of, so does this not apply to me? I guess you should know some unusual phrases. Where did you learn about them? I have a daily academic regimen. Just the other day, Junpei Tasan taught me how to write haikus. Oh, my Tartarus. Dark, decrepit Tartarus. Why are you so tall? <laughs> ah, I guess it's great. Oh, hey. Looks like you're the only guy on the team tonight. I see. So this is what you would call a harem. <laughs> According to my data, every single man in the world fantasizes about the man. <laughs> Wait, is that what you're angling for? Well, ulterior motives aside, I've no problems. After all, this team is strategically sound. I'm just trying to cycle through the, <laughs> the fucking experience. You guys are the ones with your heads in the gutter. No. God damn it. No. Just for that, we're all fucking going back and cycling out again. Uh, power instance two and floaty sandals. My favorite kind of sandals. Makes me all floaty. Physical evasion low. Cool. Now that those giant faces on the walls are gone, it's not as scary, is it? Yeah. yeah. I guess so. <laughs> Still pretty weird. <laughs> I just realized I got Akio's fist. He goes pyro jack of uh, Jack Frost. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah, the, the Jack Brother fist or whatever. Oh my god damn doodly pants. Oh, you have got to be shitting me. Ooh. Okay. Get the fuck out away from this guy. Hey, we found a person. Silly lady. All right, we'll find him. Hey, lady. Ah, <laughs> So there must be a whip. People are missing. We need to try to find treatment immediately. All right, ask for an escort. I don't want to go back. All right. <sighs> Apologies for the delay. I'll make sure this person is escorted back safely. Um. Oh, what's this? It's different from any response I've gotten until now. It's shrouded. It doesn't seem like a shadow. It's larger. It seems almost like a wall. Take a closer okay. look. Well, fortune favors the brave, right? Since so we didn't come this far, but we're running from our fights. Okay, then. Going by the signal, I'm getting it. Should be far from you. The fuck? A wall? Demon wall? Ow! There it is! Eh. Whoa, what the fuck? This is... A door? Could you please get a little closer to it? What the shit is that? Uh-huh. Mysterious ring seems to be coming from this door. Could this be the... Oh, this is the door? I thought the other thing was the door. Could this be the door Alyssa was talking about? I should check it out. This shaft's beyond the door as well. If you plan entering, please proceed with caution. All right. Let's go ahead and open the door. Is there... I'm curious. Is there like... Okay. <laughs> I was just going to check and say, I was like, can I leave? I can't leave. I was like, this is optional, isn't it? It's like a challenge room or something. 
oasis. What the shit? What? It's different here compared to outside. The atmosphere is unstable and the walls look like they're ripping. My powers aren't working very well here. I can at least tell this. It's not a very large area, but please be careful. Some weird shit up ahead. Like a mini boss? Take the shower ahead. It seems to be a very powerful one. So we have no choice to fight for to keep going. I'm ready. I think. All right. So this will be interesting. Let's go. Uh, okay. You know what? I'm just going to surrender you real quick. Uh-oh. That's great. Hey, just I can, like, confuse you or something? Nope. Hey, you're weak to this. Blah. Oh my god, we can't do the damn all-out attack. Are you serious? There we go. Okay. Whew. Something well up within me even more than usual during battle. Okay. Does this any more enemies around? Oh, this church just hit further ahead. I wonder if the shit I was guarding this. I don't think we'll have run into one like this before. Please inspect it. What the hell? I got one of these. Black cords. AS generic material. It's like what the chairman gave you before to snip a Apparently really rare. I'm surprised to see it in a place like this. Maybe the owner of the antique shop can craft a piece of equipment for me. It's time to leave. Uh, okay. Interesting. So you get like rare crafting shit here? For uh, beating a challenge? Who is scary though, dude? Uh, oh, green. What? What was that? So the, the energy from the door searched through that the entire floor. Oh, I can see the floor layout. That makes it easier for me to catch you now. Sometimes a monad door will will appear in Tartarus. Defeating the special enemy inside will trigger a special shuffle time where major arcana cards appear more frequently. Defeat the special enemy will also reveal the layout of the current floor and the floor directly above it once you exit through the door. Monad door is an unstable contraption. When one appears on a floor, the door will lose power and become inaccessible uh, if you move onto another floor, even if you return using a teleporter on the same day. Yeah, so it's a risk. Um, please return here. I'd like to go through that. Well, we know about that door. Look, there seems to be a teleporter nearby. Okay. I'm back. Who can the others are talking about that door from earlier? If I may say so. Nico, may I borrow you for a moment? Yes, person that nobody else can see. <laughs> it would appear you faced the threat beyond that door. A door connecting to that tunnel which was created within Tartarus. Perhaps an appropriate name for it would be a Monad door. The shadows of that Congregate Passage doors will prove to be a valuable means of accelerating your growth. I must know how you fared. Did your enemies provide you with a challenge? It was a rough fight. Marvelous. Excellent. I am pleased to hear that. <laughs> your place here was a rough fight. But challenging more daunting foes will act as a sort of shortcut in your de development. On another note, I've detected some sort of structure on the 91st floor. It emanates an energy not so similar to the door you entered. The mentions of the structure resemble a tunnel, what might call it a monad passage. And this passage may provide you with another opportunity to test your metal. For the time being, I will log that investigation as a personal request. Okay. Very well then. Look forward to your continued progress. But not door and a passage too. Tartarus is never gonna stop being a mystery to me. Mm. It's like a fucking video game or something. But the door appears to lead to a side path in Tartarus. In short, if you're heading to the for the top, take that path would be considered a detour of sorts. However, it seems like you'll be able to obtain something down that path that should prove helpful or exploring. Depending on how prepared you are, it may be a good idea to try these doors. If you insist. Because I have a lot more floors before I actually get there. It's a gatekeeper on the next floor. What kind of shadow could it be this time? Yeah, so this area is just completely mapped out. That's dope. The hell, is there another Monad door here? I see another red slot over there. S E E S. The matching armbands help unify us as a team. Yes, it sure fucking is. One of those doors. I what's behind it. Or if it's the same enemy, or if it's going to be different. Different. Oh boy. I'll do it. The enemy appears to be significantly stronger than average, awaiting your orders. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. 
Give me a silver fedora. Yes. All right, do let's it. do it. So it'll be interesting. Let's go. I've been waiting for this. On my own. Uh oh. Uh, oh god. The homunculus saved me. Wait to wind. Phantom Mage is chanting a death spell? Oh, goody. Don't think so, you bitch. Die! Whew. All right. Uh, last one of these. Powering Sutra. Arcanaburst, brother! Oh, take me up to level six. Hell yeah. Anti-Ice Master. Your first match attack and the next battle will do more than double damage and a bunch of experience. Let's go with a bunch of EXP. Okay, three MS Fist and AS Generic Material. Cool, this is a neat mechanic. I like this. Risk versus reward. All right. We got some weird shit. Crosses on a thing of eyeballs. Ten floors up for me, there's a border floor. That's come much, much sooner than it seems. Let's keep at it. Oh, wow, okay. That's, that was fast. And also, zone up on a higher floor. All right. So, Fedora. Yes. That is a very helpful move. Eyeballs. Leader. Oh, those crosses are actually different. Give me some shit. Yes. My friends. Okay. I mean, granted, I kind of did the Soul Fedora, so I just sort of double dipping a little bit. But I got the. At least it gets my attack up now. All right, let's do this. We're right off the bat. <gasps> Uh, nuke these motherfuckers. Okay, that was actually something he was weak to. Oh, there's a head down to there. Blah, blah, blah. Jack, Jack out here to blow them all down. Uh, dead. Ragion, oh god. Uh, ow. Okay. Enter orgy mode. Ah! Whew. Okay. We take those. Big EXP. With the acquisition of the Fire and Feather, you now views a oh, Mothman! The Winged Monstrosity of Myth. Another classic. And I got Nile Blade, too. Hey, 12 personas. Dope. All right, Windbreak. Um, Windbreak's okay, to be honest. The thing is, it doesn't make enemies weak to what you have. It just makes it so that they can take damage from it. I guess I can get rid of Margar Maguru. Next up, Maypatra. Oh, yeah. C cures, distress, confusion, charm, rage, fear. Oh, for all allies. Yes, please. Like Yanga. All right. You're a Zeo. Greetings. Enemy shadow annihilated. You possess superlative decision making skills, Nico san. That went well. It's just luck. You did great, I guess. Thank you. That battle was easy peasy lemon squeezy, as they say. <laughs> now, let us resume our exploration. Somebody says that. Slugger jacket. Oh, it's actually only for Junpei. Damn. Okay. Plus 40 HP. Junpei only drip. Golden hand. I'm going to fucking kill you this time. My sword skills got a mad upgrade, don't you think? They're distressed, except for him, of course. Except for the enemy I actually give a shit about. Yes! There we go! Good shit, Yukari! That's what I'm fucking talking about. Uh, uh, do it again! Uh, fucking do it again! Kneel uh, 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 before me, bitch! Oh, big EXP. Urgh. Hey, there's a dude. All right. Let's go save his dumb ass. Hey, wait, wait. Did I get to set pro do your typical building? Probably no use worrying. Wait, what? Do you ever wonder, I mean, given how the heavy this place must be, whether or not it'll topple over? All right. Yes. So we're going to escort this dumb ass down here. It will be me. No, I will escort the manly little dumb ass. Good for you, I guess. Yes. All right. <sighs> that is all the folks. Oh, hey, giant night guy. All right, for a big night guy, he wasn't actually that bad. All right, Junpei learn Agilao. Get rid of Agi. Uh, ooh, counter strike. Does not stack. This one doesn't actually say it doesn't. Yeah, this is, this one doesn't stipulate that, so maybe, I don't know. I mean, if this one doesn't stack, then it means, yeah, just replace her. Arrows are a single use item. So I end up spending a surprising amount of money on them. 
<laughs> I bet. Here we thought they were endless. Maybe if I were she's just like, I can't attack anymore. Getsu A. I don't even know what that one is. Uh, slash damage to one foe. More damage closer to a full moon. Ah, one of those weird ones. All right. What are we dealing with on this door? A big box. Or is a guy in there? Infuriate. Uh oh. That's going to be provoked. Shit. Wait to ice. Good. I never thayered you, too. So that's going to do some damage on this bitch. Not a rune, duh. Oh, shit. No. Put that back. Damn, that was a lot of damage. Holy shit. You motherfucker. Oh. All right. Funny, I, I actually... Uh, wow, I went to the trouble of removing that. I thought it was going to be uh, that he was like a, a new to physical attacks, but uh, I guess not. <laughs> Damn, did you see how much damage Junpei did with that hit? Okay, Onyx and Nile Cloth. Oh, damn. The Getsu I got that Getsuwe move. I put it on the Pale Rider. So one day, one day away from a full moon with that on uh, an enemy that had his defense lower, but it did 200 damage. That's fucking good. The alien floor. It sounds like we've made a lot of progress, but I get the feeling we still have a long way to go. We're not even halfway there, Mitsuru. Damn, big naked Hardware bull thing. To help here, so we'll have to find our way through. All right. What are we dealing with? Uh, wait, hold on. Give me that boost. All right, last enemy for this section, so this is probably gonna be pretty tough. This should be fun. Come on. Bow, 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 bow. Let's go ahead and just debuff these fuckers. While they debuff me, apparently. Oh god, he's gonna charge. Fuck. Oh god. Oh no, this guy's debuffer, man. Oh god, buffing himself up more. With the Jack Brothers. Ah, there's a weakness. Oh, him with the electricity, baby. Uh, full debuff, but you know what? Oracle, please, please rebuff us or just bring us back to back to zero again. SP's good, I guess. Kill the debuffer. Fuck. Rebe oh my god, they just keep buffing and debuffing. Power is fully charged. Oh, Jesus God Almighty, what have I done? Oh, wait, I have. You know if I. Oh, this is stat debuffs. Shit. I had no idea. I, I thought it was the the one that moved debuffs, uh, buffs from the enemy. Well, that's helpful. Ah. Move all stat buffs from all foes. Hey! Oh, I, oh, this right, but it, it doesn't work on... I've always thought this was stupid. Th this shit doesn't work on, um... Freaking, uh, charge. Are you kidding me? Yeah, there we go. There we go. Uh, block. Uh, we're dead. Blah, we should have. I should have blocked. Hey, I flicked poison on this fucker. That's awesome. Yeah, the the debuffer guys are, sucks, but I, I can actually just deal with him with uh with Igus. Oh, that's a big wow, huge damage. Fully charged. Oh, big damage. And with a big punch. Oh, there we go. All right. Just kill that guy for you. Oh, Jesus. Just kill that guy before he kills us, essentially. Dead. Hell yeah, baby. Woo! Cruel attack. Deal medium pierce damage to one foe. More damage to downed foe. Okay. Oh, she actually gets a healing spell. Nice. Balm of life. However, we've not come across that passage. Is that so? Is that actually over here? Oh God, it's a fucking. Powerful enemy spotted. Please be careful. Oh 
It's a fucking double. Next floor is the border floor, and seemingly we're gonna have like uh another like like passageway over here. So they're gonna give me like one after a boss. Some crazy shit. Jesus. Drink the goddamn Mad Bull, guys. Blah, 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 blah. Enter in combat. Come and get it, as they say. <laughs> okay, two dancers. Okay, one block's lightning. lightning. Oh, God. Uh, oh, no. Ugh. Get the shit out of here. Oh, what the hell? He blocks physical attacks? Oh, boy. Defense up. Any chance that I can... Uh... Okay, that goes through it. Okay, all right. So that... Well, that got rid of it, at least. I wonder if status, status effects would be... Uh, good on these guys. Got one of them. With the poison. Ah! That didn't do a lot. Oh, Jesus. Nice miss, dickhead. And big damage. Blocks Palimpa. This thing is weak to nothing. Piece of shit. And this thing's weak. This thing is weak to uh, uh, piercing attacks. He fucking dodged it, you sack of shit. Him with the cruel attack. Ah! No, don't heal him. Oh, they heal each other. Ugh. Aren't you guys just a big pain in the dick? Ah! This thing's almost dead. Ah! Get that shit out of here. All right, just you now, motherfucker. The controller partner is grieving. What control controlling part? Oh, that's funny. You're just gonna sit there and take it now? Fucking okay with that. Grieve and die! Oh, fucking critical hell yeah. Get fucked. See you later, dickhead. Now our Jerbo or GM mode is actually pretty good in this. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna lie. It's like, I mean you lose control of her, but she's not like super stupid. And she just does a fuck ton of damage. May Patra. Hell yeah. Nice work. These case teamers are super tough, huh? Might be time to call it a day. What do you think? I'm just getting started. Hmm. Well, someone's motivated. Okay, see how far we can get then. We're like right at the end here, Yukari. Come on. Not I mentioned, I think there might be that fucking door here. Please hold a moment. Yup. It's one of those doors, but huh, this one isn't shiny with the others. It feels different too. This is the structure Elizabeth referred to as the as not dissimilar to the other door. I should probably check this door. Ooh, fists of fury, nice. Strike boost. This says high high chance of inflicting charm. It's actually weaker, but it comes with strike boost. Strengthens the strike attacks, which would technically strengthen his fists. I don't know. Uh, I'll give it a try. I mean, I'm getting it way later than the other thing, so I'm just gonna assume that that's better. Hopefully, the thing is, it'll affect, it also will affect my um my spells, right? What? Battle panties? What in the fuck? Dangerously revealing armor. It might fit you, Kari. No fucking way. What in the hell is this lewd shit? Wow. We just like to abuse a Yukari in this game, don't we? Jeez. God damn, boy. Yeah. <laughs> is it just her? Just Yukari. Just, just Yukari. I won't do that to Yukari. I assume I can't leave this area. Otherwise, I'll lose the door. I don't know. Uh, it's a risk, but we'll just do it. Seems like it won't open. Do you see anything that I'm missing? Major Arcana I have on me is reacting. Wait, the door is glowing. Why all of a sudden? Did you do something, Leader? The Major Arcana card. Tarker, you have us wrecked to the door? The card acts like a key to this door. Interesting. This door certainly works differently from the others we've seen. 
A Manab Passage is a type of Manab door leading to the depths of Tartarus. There's one per section of a block. Each Manab Passage opens in response to a major arcana card. A formidable shadow resides in the innermost, and beyond it lies a treasure a treasure chest holding a valuable item. The entrance to the Manab Passage will remain permanently on the same floor in the same location, even after a turn of a new day. If you feel outmatched, consider revisiting after training some. Oh, okay. Well, since they danger immediate vicinity, how about there might be a strong enemy further in? Okay, okay. All right, I come back. Thank God. All right, let me go save before I attempt this. There's a lot of wild shit in this game, man. Oh, a lot of cool nuances and like fresh things they add that make it a lot of fun. <laughs> One fly stairs down. At least deeper into the depths of Tars compared to the other doors. This looks like a strong to go all the way in. It's a little disturbing. Give me a boost to my defense and speed. Uh, uh, where is he? Where is this motherfucker? Another door. Another door. Even inside the first door, it feels like a very long pathway. So yeah, I've never seen before. Please be careful as you go on. Um, you're a deep part of the passage now. Pass separate by the source even deeper. Please be careful. It's just a big one of these things. Um, I see the shadow up ahead. Oh, interesting. It's got the one on his head. It's, it's like the one from the very start of the game. Looks like we'll have to defeat it to continue on. Seems rather weak for a shadow inside one of these doors. I have a bad feeling about this. Please be fully prepared if you plan to battle it. Uh. Powerful enemy. All right. Time to do this. There's one enemy. It's a big boy. I'm just gonna debuff the shit out of you. Uh oh. Cowardly. Oh, it's cowardly Maya. It's a little like the first enemy you encounter too. Uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Okay, we're doing damage. Get together, get ya, Megiddo. Oh, pain. Horrendous pain. Give me the full analysis. Weak to anything? Nope. Just weak to nothing. Not be time for this shit. 200 HP to everybody. Ow. Give us a boost, Fuka. Yes. That's what I wanted. Do it, Junpei. Time to die. <laughs> Get to ya. Get ya. Yes. Go. Go team! Arrgh! Oh, you dead, bitch. You fucking dead. Give me that big ass experience. Ugh. Oh, I didn't give me that much experience. Shadow Limited, good work! So I'm the only one who thought this would be easy, because it definitely wasn't, and that kind of caught me off guard. Really? It caught you off guard after having to go through like two doors? Because it depends on the treasure book by its cover. Next time, I'll be more careful. So there's more up ahead, so let's check it out. Yeah, it's funny. It's like a super version of one of like the bo most basic enemies in the game. I mean, just a bad but an enemy presence there too. Are you serious? Okay. Oh, really? So we gotta go through. We gotta go through more than one? Come on, that's a bullshit. Oh. Ice saber. Probably a good weapon. They're better than what you had. I don't think you even had anything all that unique. A freeze boost. Hell yeah. Memoir 2. Even shadows have unique traits. The more hostile ones display great strength, but can't be controlled by in our current facility. We developed the Cathedral of Time to avoid disposal of such unique specimens. Interesting. Gekukon jersey. My PE outfit. Yeah, looking ready now. Is this just like gonna keep going? So it's, okay, so it's like another level to it. Okay, not a basic looking one anymore. I don't know, might, this might be just one you just keep coming back to. Oh, there's three of them? What the fuck? Tetracarn. Okay. I assume this thing must be weak to physical, all right? I gotta just get rid of this shit. Ow. Did some damage. 
Let's put my sister, sister Karm back on. Ow. Whew. Dead. The shit out of here. Makara Karn. So you're like the support dude, that this little guy. Oh, okay, you can be charmed. Gotcha. <laughs> Smack. All right, this fucker's dead. One more. Yes. I'm to the ground. Dead. Oh, all right. Thank God. Uh, Takemi Kazuchi. Hey, that looks familiar, doesn't it? That looks familiar. Shadow Limited, good work. That reminds me. Just now, each shadow just doesn't your role, and their actions are all well coordinated. The team where individuals can cover each other's weaknesses can be formidable, but at least we are being merged victorious. It's all because we have a materially exceptional leader. I'll be counting you in the next battle as well. So you defeat all the shadows in this area. All right, dope. So it's just two. Okay, good. I was like, dude, come on. <laughs> no more. No more. Oh my god, really? You get to the bottom and there's a locked chest? God, I hope you have enough for it. Oh, hello. It's quite the trip. I found a familiar step beyond that imposing enemy. It's rather secure. Can you get it open? Treasure chest isn't locked. <gasps> you can open it as it is. Oh, thank god. So this is some trouble. We're a rather regular area. I wonder if there's a special feature of the place. I'll take any digits to check what's inside. Behold. Temperance Tarot. Book of Semech. The Temperance Major Arcana cannot be uh, pure during the shuffle. The next time you do a daily activity, your academics, courage, and charm will increase more than usual for that day. Well, that's interesting. Granted, I'm getting sort of towards the end, so that's how useful that's going to be at this point in the game. Book of Semech is, the, is the number of Major Arcana cards attainable in a day increased by one. Cool. Beyond Darkness. Unlocked accessing access to remaining Major Arcana. Seems similar to the ones you already have, Leader. So let's react to the entrance, so there may be some connection there. So let's see the doors elsewhere react to that card as well. Uh -huh. Alright, let's head back. Alright, and I believe that this is the top. This is... So we can't progress further for now. On the other hand, we make good headway. Nicely done. All right, and give me my reward. Old document four. The head researcher came to try and convince me. I was surprised. He was my old mentor. Whenever I remember his timid smile, my resolve wavers. We did it. We fucking did it. Elizabeth, give me my rewards as well. Well done, I'm fulfilling my request. The Mumbinot passage expl you explore seems to be slightly different from the usual doors you've encountered. Well, they may both house strong shadows, the passage seems to lead deeper into to the depths, thus harboring even more powerful shadows. The rewards you reap are far greater. <laughs> By defeating all the shadows within the passage, you will gain a new major arcana, which in turn will aid your growth. I won't force you to undertake this, taste this task, but I do hope you continue to challenge these passages whenever you can. Those of us who reside in the Velvet Room are pleased to bear witness to such growth. That will also bring me one step closer to filling my true oh, desire. Oh, my apologies. I didn't intend to take up so much of your time babbling. The Black Sword. Uh, defeat a rare shadow in the third block. Let's hear the results. Onyx, fourth document, $40,000. Yeah, it seems like it depends on what section you're in. If you're in the second section, you get 20K. If you're in the third second, 30, 30K. And now we've reached the fourth section, so we got 40K. Whew. All right, guys. I think that's a good spot to end things here for now. That was a long recording session for me. Oh, my God. It was like over four hours <laughs> recording. That took a long time to get through all that. Kept throwing more new shit at me and tougher enemies. It was like, God dang. It was fun, man. It was a lot of fun. It's funny. I thought I remember I guess being kind of bad, honestly, in like the base game. And like, I don't remember her using her like a ton, but she's actually pretty good here. I don't know if they really changed much or if I'm just, you know, misremembering, but her or, or GMO was actually pretty damn good when I was using it in those fights. I was, I was impressed. You did good, I guess. I'm proud of you. Thank you, missile -san. That means something to me. I'm still trying to figure that out. Uh, but anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoy this episode. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite. And subscribe if you're not already. Become a picky penguin. How boy the SLP. Where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. And as always, guys, till next time. 
Stay classy!